we uh we got a project this this weekend yeah I did it all right I'm gonna go over this just a little bit just because I appreciate the packing job it's very minimal the bike was very secure doesn't look to be any damage so kudos FedEx for not fucking up my shit <laughs> um and uh yeah I'm gonna start I mean they, they I think I'm pretty sure so far the only tool I've had to have was a razor knife to cut the bike open and I think they sent everything you need in the packaging so I'm gonna give it a shot I just just wanted to touch I'm now you know I paid for this bike I'm don't sponsor this company or anything like that I just I appreciate it because I live in a small town garbage is highly expensive I've seen some of these videos I mean I watched a lot of videos before I purchased um, did my due diligence some might argue with my choice but 25 amp hour battery for average price where y'all's getting what 14 15 on some of them yeah I did my due diligence anyhow this uh the way they got this packaged I, I, like I was saying I've seen some of them other videos and it's nuts on how much packaging they put in the bike these guys thought about it every piece was molded to fit the pieces on the seat that went over the handlebars that went on the seat it was nicely in there like such bang I mean it was it was well thought out I've done a lot of manufacturing so kudos guys good job so far I'm completely thrilled with my purchase the the, the everything that come in it the the little envelope and everything it was kind of I, I, I get it not gonna get it but I get it um, yeah all right y'all watching this it's because you're thinking about getting one of these um, in the beginning I was pretty impressed not that I'm not happy with the bike but I want to warn you the company is not the greatest company to work with for different reasons they don't they're not very talkative none of their phone works or phone numbers rather are active um, and their support if you do get an email back from them it's very short and non-conversational uh, and not helpful plus you know I don't know I, I'm not a bike mechanic I don't have much experience with bikes but I ain't never seen no shit like that <laughs> It's like the inner tube is two times bigger. I mean, it's look at that. It's folded up. This is how it was when it went flat, folks. The tail light, the wires were pulled way too tight, so it busted during shipping. The, not the plate, the, the housing that fastens to the light plate itself or the, the, the base. So it got kind of broken shipping at some point um, and I tried to super glue it back on but at some point during the bike ride it came completely off so that's no good um, other than that the bike is solid 
hands down 25 amp hour it's a, it's a lot of it's a lot of life on a battery compared to the other bikes out there i'm just there you go folks that's honest real deal that's what you get when you spend that thousands you know almost a couple thousand dollars on this here model um it is fast and you know i'm 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 probably buck five soaking wet so i'm not really i guess i'm about 130 pounds somewhere in there so i got this thing up to 32 and a half miles per hour so it definitely goes fast um and i did take it out to some places that were kind of muddy harder to get through um a steep incline up a river bank um and this thing will do it it'll get it that's the truth of it but you can see manufacturing wise I don't, I don't know if that's common practice or what's up with that um, i'm gonna talk to the bike shop guy and see what's what's up i mean i don't know if, if that's standard pro practices my apologies but <laughs> i thought they made inner tubes that fit the size tire you were using you know what i mean so anyhow that's my take on it um i'm not saying don't buy one i'm just saying these this is my experience and uh good luck with yours